Good morning, Greater Latrobe. From the WCAT TV studio, I'm Corbin Makar alongside Gianna Ferry, and these are your morning announcements. Any student who will be taking online health semester two should report to C106 on Friday, January 18th during your assigned study hall or free period, or during Lunch and Learn 2 to obtain information on how to log on and navigate the class. If you cannot attend the meeting, please stop in the 910 or 1112 office to obtain the syllabus and email your assigned teacher ASAP. Seven Springs, Laurel Valley, and Hidden Valley have several winter positions available. If you are interested in applying, visit sevenspringscom employment to fill out an application. The UPMC Hillman Cancer Center Academy is taking applications now through February 8th. This is an eight-week experience running from June 10th to August 2nd. Students chosen will spend their summer working on a cutting-edge research project while receiving mentorship from Pitt faculty and researchers. Applicants must be over the age of 15. Any student wishing to apply should see Mr. Princeton in the 1112 office for more information. Attention seniors and juniors. If you would like to be a 6th grade camp counselor, applications are available in the 1112 office. Counselors are needed in the following areas. General group counselors, certified lifeguards, art and fishing. If you are able to help with rifle and archery, the hunter safety course completion is required. The deadline to apply is Friday, February 15th. If you're interested, do not delay in completing and turning in your application. Available spots will fill fast. Now here's Devin Watson with the weather report. Good morning, Wildcats. It's time for your local weather report. Today, expect some snow showers throughout the day, along with a high of 36 and a low of 32. Tomorrow, we'll have heavy snow showers again, along with a high of 37 and a low of 26. And on Saturday, we'll have even more snow with a small chance to turn into sleet, along with a high of 37 and a low of 31. Snow probability for the next three days is 2 to 3 inches of snow. That's all for your weather report. Thanks, and back to you. Thanks, Devin. Are you interested in using the library's 3D printer but missed previous training sessions? Ms. Rebel will once again be offering training during Lunch and Learn. There will be a 3D printer training during Lunch and Learn 2 for the rest of the week. Sign up on FlexTime Manager if you're interested. The meeting for the Latrobe Winter Games has been pushed back to next Tuesday, January 22nd during Lunch and Learn 2. Details about the event will be discussed. Please email Devin Watson if you cannot attend the meeting or have questions. All seniors are asked to check your school email for diploma information. All diploma forms need to be completed and submitted by the end of January. The Greater Lake Trobe Interact Club is teaming up with the Ligonier Interact Club to host a lip sync battle in the Ligonier Auditorium on Friday, February 15th. All Lake Trobe and Ligonier High School students and teachers are invited to participate in the battle with the group of their choosing. There will be prizes for the top three acts. More information will be distributed later, but start forming your groups now to get your song and routine ready. Please check your email and fill out the Google form that was sent to you as soon as possible. Now here's Alex Bizignani with the sports report. Thanks, Gianna, and welcome to the Wildcat Sports Report. The swimming and diving team is home tonight. They take on Kiski at 6. The girls basketball team is also home tonight as they go against Albert Gallatin at 7.30. Congratulations to Letterman's Club Athlete of the Week, senior David Marincha. Last week in the section meet against Armstrong, David was part of four first place finishes. As an individual, he won the 50 freestyle. David also swam in three relays and was an important part of helping all three take first place. The 200 medley race, or relay, achieved the Whippeal qualifying time. Congratulations, David. We will be back after this message. Thanks, Alex. All 9th through 12th grade girls interested in playing high school soccer next year should attend an informational meeting on January 29th at 5.30 p.m. in the high school cafeteria. The meeting will also discuss the Icebreakers Indoor Soccer Tournament. 
This is the last chance to buy your yearbook. The deadline is January 31st. The cost of each book is only $91. Additional information can be found on the school district website. The National College Fair is being held at the David L. Lawrence Convention Center on Thursday, February 7th and Friday, February 8th. Please stop by the 1112 waiting area for more information. Now, here's Preston Yingling with What's Cooking Lake Grove. Hey, what's cooking, Lake Grove? It's Thursday, January 17th, and the main line will be cooking up spaghetti with hearty meatballs and half a cup of mixed vegetables. Over on the cultural corner, we got my personal favorite, 12 pieces of General Tso's popcorn chicken with fluffy brown rice and half a cup of mixed vegetables. Finally, the soup of the day is Fiesta Taco, and that's what's cooking. Thanks and back to you guys. Thanks, Preston. Do you love to sing? Auditions for the Greater Latrobe Chamber Choir will be held on February 4th, 5th, 11th, and 12th after school. Stop by the choir room to pick up audition materials and sign up for an audition time slot outside of the choir room. Not quite ready for an audition? Concert Choir is an incredibly talented ensemble open to all voices. No audition necessary. The Greater Latrobe Choirs look forward to singing with you next year. Reporting for WCAT-TV, this has been Gianna Ferry and Corbin Makar. Thanks for watching and have a great day.